What you guys got another video here for you in this one we're going to be taking a look at how we can do a repair install inside Windows 10 now if you're having big issues with Windows 10 and you want to reinstall it and you don't want to lose any data whatsoever or any programs or anything like that then this video is for you so for instance if you're suffering from say start menu problems or it's not working you can use this method I'm going to show you if you've got apps that don't work you can use this method uh, to uh, reinstall and repair Windows without losing any data if you've got a corrupt system files and you can't fix them then this method will work if you've got malware on the system and it's made changes and you and you can't fix it then this will also work for that problem as well if you've also got uh, failed Windows updates and upgrades so if you've upgraded the system or you've got a failed Windows update this will fix it and you will uh, not lose any data again uh, if you've uh, done a Windows update now and uh, all of a sudden something's not working say the internet or something like that and you've tried everything then this method will work for you so what we're going to do is take a look at the repair install now there's a couple of important steps you have to be at the the uh, desktop screen here for it to work okay so you can't boot up to the windows cd and try and do a repair install that way it won't work so also there is this method here which will look at settings here and we'll come down to where it says up update and security and inside here you will see a couple of areas now if you click on the reset this PC area the problem with this method is you will lose uh, some sort of data you'll see here keep my files but it will remove apps and settings and stuff like that the method I'm going to show you it will will not remove anything and it will be exactly how it was uh, when you was using it the last time okay so let's get started so what we're going to need to do here is get the uh, Windows 10 now if you've already got a copy of Windows 10 you can use that uh, but it's always best to get the latest version and you can see here uh, we have the uh, Windows 10 free download tool here now also it's good to uh, get this and get the latest version so what we're going to do here is save this to here and also what I'm going to do is just going to drag this to the desktop here so if I open up in folder and I'm going to grab this out here okay so here we have our tool so from here what we can do is now click on this I'm going to right click on this and run this as administrator click yes now once this opens up it's going to get a few things ready okay so we're going to accept the license agreement so what we're going to do here is click on upgrade this PC now this process will take a bit of time okay that's just going to verify our download and it's going to create our Windows 10 media for us now so it's going to start to uh, prepare Windows and then check for updates. Now I want to try and get all the latest updates uh, before we do our repair install. And you're going to see this window opening and closing quite a fair bit. And now we can uh, continue. I'm going to accept the terms and conditions and now you can see it's going to try to get some updates for us it's checking for updates to see if there's any available okay so we're moving on to the next step which is uh, ready to install and you can see it says install Windows 10 Pro and also keep personal files and apps they are both ticked and you can see here we've got a little light purple color saying change what to keep if you click on this you will see uh, keep personal files and apps uh, keep personal files only or nothing and uh, this will delete everything but we're just going to leave it on this top one here I'm going to go next and it will check for updates and then continue and get ready to install uh, Windows okay so now it is ready to install it was just checking to see if we had enough space on the drive to install and then what we're going to do next is go install 
Now it's going to complete uh, the installation process of Windows 10. The computer may restart a few times during this process and this process does take a fair bit of time so be patient. So the updating process will continue. It's just working on updates as you can see. So we'll just let this continue. So there's the updates now completed. We'll just uh, start to log in. You can see here we've updated your PC. That's just going to start up your Windows now as you can see. And there we are back at the desktop. Everything as we left it and all your problems will be resolved if you had that issue uh, previous to doing the Windows repair install that should now be fixed. So that's basically how you can do a repair install on Windows 10. I hope this one has been helpful and useful to you guys. I'm going to wrap this one up. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos guys then hit the like button. Also hit the subscribe button if you want to keep up to date when we upload new videos. Also, if you've got any uh, problems with your computers or you just want to join the community, then the forum's the place to be. Okay? Anyway, have a great Christmas, guys, and I'll see you again in the next video. Bye for now.